So good day everyone, I am Dennis Nordlan and I'm the one PSCC. So for today, we are going to solve one example of trigonometric function. Tan x plus cos squared times x squared all over sin x sin times x squared minus x. So first, we need to, sim to simplify cos, cos squared times x squared all over sin sin times x squared. To simplify this, um, cos cos x squared all over sine x squared times cosine x squared so cosine x squared all over sine x squared is cotangent x squared Tangent x squared, then copy the cosine x squared. So this, this is the result. Copy the tangent x plus cotangent x squared cosine x squared. Copy the x minus x. Then we need to derive this, this function. Uh, the derivative form of tangent x is equal to secant squared x plus the derivative of cotangent x squared cosine x squared is cosecant squared x squared the derivative of 2x is, is, is equal and the, x, the derivative of x squared is equal to 2x then cosine x squared then the derivative of cosine x squared is equal to cotangent x squared times mag i times minus sine x squared the derivative of x squared is 2x. The derivative of x is equal to negative 1. So next, I'm copy the second squared x minus 2x cosine x squared to second squared x squared minus 2x sine 2x sine x squared to tangent x squared minus 1. So, so this is not yet the final answer. We need to simplify it this answer uh, simplify this is second squared x then negative 1 so negative 2x to second x squared I cosine x squared to second squared x squared minus 2x sine x squared to tangent x squared plus tangent squared x so that is the final answer So the second one is the logarithmic function. So we have here the example. The derivative of uh, the derivative of ln times x cubed over 2. So the formula for logarithmic function function is ln u is equal to u prime over u. So in this problem the u here is x cubed minus over 2. Then derive the derive the derive this u prime is equal to x cubed over 2. Derivative of x cubed is 3x squared times 2 minus 0. All over I all over the the squared of denominator which is 2 raised to 2. So 3x squared times 2 is equal to 6x squared all of over 4, 2 times 2. Then, we can simplify this, this, this form. Let us multiply this by, hey, let us divide this by 2, both sides, 3x squared over 2. So, we we have we have we have a, we have found the u prime so now let's substitute substitute to the formula so u prime is 3x squared minus over 2 all over u which is x cubed over 2 
So, the final answer is d over dx and the derivative of ln u or x cube over 2 is equal to 3 over x. So, the third one is exponential function. One example of that is f of x is equal to e to the power of square root of x squared plus 2 plus e to the power of 3x cubed. So the formula for this is derivative to derive this, this function, we have this formula. d over dx e raised to u is equal to e to the power of u times d over dx. So our u here, we have 2u. The first u is the square root of x squared plus 2. This is 1. And the other one is 3x cubed. This one. So, we need to substitute the e. So, the e is e, e raised to x squared plus square root of x squared plus 2 times the derivative of u. So, we need to derive the first u. The first u is this one. We need to derive square root of x squared plus 2. u prime is equal to x squared plus 2 raised to 1 half, which is the square root. Then, minus 1. So, the answer is x squared plus 2 raised to negative 1 half times the derivative, the derivative of x squared is equal to 2x. So, simplify it. We have we have 2x over square root of x squared plus 2. So, that is the first u prime. So, substitute it. 2x all over x square root of x squared plus 2. Then, the derivative of 2x is equal to 2. Cancel this. Cancel, cancel, plus, plus, the other e, e, 3, raised to 3x cubed. Then, it's the derivative of 3x cubed is 9x squared. So, what? So, the final answer is, e, raised to square root of x squared plus 2, times x all over square root of x squared plus 2 plus e raised to 3x cubed plus a times 9x squared. So that is the final answer. So the last one is the maxima and minima. So we have the problem here. A page is to contain 24 square inch of grid. The margins at top and bottom are 1.5 inch and the sides is 1 inch. Find the most economic, economic, economical dimensions of the page. So this is the breadth, breadth area and this is the margin which is in the side, sides margin 1 inch. And the top and the bottom margin is 1.5. So, x minus 2, which is the <coughs> bx, and the y is y minus 3, is equal to 24, which is the total, the total square inch of this whole page. So, the page area, so we derive this equation into, into this. We need to, to get the value of y. So, y is equal to 24 all over x minus 2 plus 3. So, the page area, so the area is a, which is the area, is equal to x times y. So, substitute x, so we, we don't have x, 
and we have the y. So y x times y is equal to 20, x times 24 over x minus 2 plus 3 is equal to 24x over x minus 2 plus 3x. So the derivative of 24x minus x minus 2 plus 3x is equal to x minus 2 times 24 minus 24x times 1 all over uh, over the, the square of denominator which is x minus 2 raised to 2. So is equal to 48 over x minus 2 squared plus 3 is equal to 0. So, negative 48 plus 3 times x minus 2 squared is equal to 0. So, the x is equal to 48 over 3 plus 2 uh, is equal to 6 inches. 48 divided by 3 is equal to 16. 16. Then the square root of 16 is equal to 4 plus 2 is equal to 6 inches. And the y is 24 minus x, which is the 6. Substitute x, I substitute 6 to x is equal to 6 minus 2 plus 3. So 24 over, over 4 is equal to 6 plus 3 is equal to 9 inches. So the dimensions, the economical, the economical dimensions of the page is equal to 6, 6, 6 inches by 